الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى اله وصحبه وسلم اما بعد احببت في الله in a beautiful hadith the hadith of abu huraira رضي الله تعالى عنه he reported that the messenger of allah صلى الله عليه وسلم said Allah the Most High says, He who is hostile to a companion of mine, I declare war against him. My slave approaches me with nothing more beloved to me than what I have made obligatory for him. And my slave keeps drawing closer to me with voluntary acts until I love him. And when I love him, I become his hearing with which he hears. His sight with which he, he, he sees, his hand with which he seizes, and his foot with which he walks. If he asks me, I will surely give him, and if he seeks refuge in me, I will surely protect him. Ruahu uh, Bukhari. In this hadith of the Prophet, وسلم, there are immense benefits, Ahabatifillah. And from those benefits, scared to death, it was a bird. And from those benefits is this is a hadith of Qudsi, meaning that this is a hadith that the Prophet wasallam narrated on Rabbihi, on his Lord, Allah, Tabarak wa ta'ala, the creator of the heavens and earth. And he said that Allah the Most High says, he who was hostile to a wali of mine, I declare war against him. So we see in the beginning of the hadith, Allah tabarak wa ta'ala is stating on the tongue of his messenger sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi wa sallam that he has companions, he has those who he loves and supports. Allah tabarak wa ta'ala has those who he loves from the righteous, the salihin. And this shows us, sahabatifillah, that we have a higher purpose in this life to which we should aim to be. We should aim to be from those supported by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Those whom are loved by Allah azza wa jal. Because if Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala loves you, then it doesn't matter what anyone else thinks about you. So he said, the one who is hostile to a wali of mine, you know, one of my companions, one of those I, I love, one of those I protect, I declare war on him. So if someone, as we know, the casualties of war are many in this dunya. And I don't think any of us can imagine or want to be of those who Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala declares war upon. That that is the most severe uh, and the most... Uh, the most stern of those you want to oppose. You never want to oppose your Lord to Barak wa Ta'ala. So if you declare war and you oppress and you harm and you speak ill about those who Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala loves, understand that you are on the verge of having war made against you. And then he said, my slave approaches me with nothing more beloved to me than what I've made obligatory upon him. So here we see that the wajib, the most, the greatest deeds that you can do is the five pillars of Islam, doing it the best that you can. Those obligatory duties, knowing and understanding Tawheed. Verily, it's an obligation upon us to know four things. The first thing is knowledge. And it's knowledge of who Allah is. And knowledge of His Prophet, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. And knowledge of the religions of Islam with His textual proofs. So, we have to have Islamic knowledge of the oblig obl obligatory duties. We have to know how to pray. We have to know how to make tahara. And if you do those things that are an obligation upon you, Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala will love you. You will be of those loved by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Doing the five daily prayers. So it shows us the importance 
of establishing your prayer. That that is one of the ways to earn the love of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So it shows us the importance of that second pillar of Islam. And that's why it's a pillar of Islam. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, My slave approaches me with nothing more beloved to me than what I have made obligatory for him. And my slaves <coughs> keep my slave keeps drawing closer to me with voluntary acts until I love him. And when I love him, I become his hearing in which he hears, his sight with which he sees, his hand with which he seizes, and his foot with which he walks. So a habatifillah doing the voluntary prayers, praying your witr, praying your sunnas, your sunan, praying uh, tahajir or qiyam al-layl, praying uh, fasting, extra fasting, fasting Mondays and Thursdays, all of that is voluntary deeds. Voluntary deeds, they're extra deeds on top of the obligatory deeds. And if you do that for the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, in accordance with the sunnah of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, you will earn the love of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And when we look at ourselves and we see our own taqsir and our own weakness, we see that we're usually not doing many of those things. So how is it can we gain the love of Allah? How do we get frustrated when Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala doesn't answer our du'as and 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 we feel like we're not supported and we're not protected by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala when we don't do those things to earn his love and earn his protection. So it shows us, Ahabatifillah, to do your obligatory duties, pray, fasting, uh, sadaqah, uh, zakat, all those things that do the obligatory duties and do the extra acts of ibadah to, to, to earn the love and support of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And then he mentioned that the one who is doing these acts of worship, that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will support him by making his actions in accordance with what Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala loves. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, uh, and when I love him, I become his hearing with which he hears, his sight with which he sees, his hand with which he seizes. Meaning that th everything that the person does will be in accordance with obedience to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, will be in accordance with ta'atillah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And we ask Allah wa ta'ala, the Almighty, to accept our good and forgive our evil and bless us to be from Ahli Iman and bless us with ilm al nafi and rizqan tayyib wa amal al And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala love us and may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala forgive us and guide us. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyya Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.